What's going on guys? I am doing a top speed build of the 2012 Nissan GTR R35 Black Edition. This car is really sick. Was the fastest car in Forza Motorsport 5. So I wanted to see how it parred in uh, Forza Horizon 2. And uh, it's unfortunately not as fast as it was. Uh, I mean, I, I knew that was going to happen. I knew they were going to, uh, you know, detune it a little bit. Um, there's significant uh, upgrades that you can't do uh, in Forza Horizon 2 with this car that you could do in Forza 5 that probably had an impact. Uh, but I think just in general, they just detuned it uh, because it was just wickedly fast in Forza 5. Honestly, just unreal. I mean, I, I couldn't see a car like this getting that fast uh, like it did in Forza 5 in real life. Um, I mean, like that was just, it was just insane. But for Forza Horizon 2, I, th I, I would say this speed is pretty good. Uh, especially for this type of car being only a hundred thousand credits i think it's i think it's overall a really good speed they put it at which uh, i got it at 268.8 miles per hour uh, which is really really fast in my opinion that's probably this is probably uh one of the fastest cars that you could get in the game i'd say at least in the top 10 uh, as the fastest cars so i mean you're not going to go wrong with this car hundred thousand credits this car is very very flexible you know you can do a lot of racing um, it's all-wheel drive start off, so you can you you know, you know you can do some rallying if you want. I mean, I wouldn't really suggest it. Uh, there's tons of other ones. But, I mean, you could do drifting with this car. You can just do, you know, modern supercar racing. I mean, there's there's tons and tons of opportunities with this car. Um, that's why it makes it so great, you know what I mean? Uh, but here is the actual tune itself, so you guys can copy it down. This is how I set it up. If you guys want to change the gearing up a little bit, you know, to make it a little bit faster off the start, by all means do so. But just try and keep... Keep your 268.8 uh, mile per hour uh, final speed, you know what I mean? Um, but here we go. The interior of this baby looks really nice, especially with the uh, Forza Horizon 2 graphics. It looks beautiful. I got this paint scheme off the, you know, off the storefront. I mean, it's not too great. I wish they, uh, I mean, it is like the first day the game came out, so I'm not, I shouldn't expect uh, amazing designs yet. Uh, but I do like it. It's not bad. I like the red with the white because um, it matches the logo, uh, the GTR logo is uh, white and red, so it looks pretty good. Uh, but overall, this thing is extremely fast, as you can see. I actually found uh, this highway is the best highway, I would say, uh, to do these top speed runs. I mean, there's another one that you could do it on, but there's too many, uh, there's too many curves and stuff. Uh, this one, by far, is the best, and you want to go this direction, because if you go the opposite way, uh, you're slightly going upwards, which reduces your speed. You can top out around like 260, uh, but going downwards, you get to 268. So this is probably the best way to do it if you guys want to do any uh, speed runs or any you know any races. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Show your support for me. I really appreciate it by liking this video, commenting, and subscribing. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Thanks. See ya.